Noise. The first sign of an earthquake may be a loud bang or roar. Drop, cover, and hold. Stay calm, drop to the floor, take cover under an object, and hold on to it. Falling objects. Stay clear from any objects that can move or fall and potentially injure you. Avoid windows. Windows can easily shatter and cause serious injuries. Take shelter. The safest structures to protect you are solid inside walls, corners, and hallways. No elevators. Never use an elevator during or after an earthquake. If you find yourself inside one, get off as quickly as possible. When you feel the first ground motions, you must immediately drop to the floor. Take cover under a desk or table. If you're not near a desk or table, drop to the floor against an interior wall. Resist the urge to panic. Stay put and do not move from under the shelter. Research has shown that most injuries occur when people inside buildings attempt to move to a different location inside the building or try to leave it. So, do not run outside where you could be vulnerable to the danger of falling debris. Stay away from windows, bookcases, cabinets, or other objects that could topple and fall. Hold on until the shaking stops. The reason to hold on to the desk or table is, if it moves, you move with it. At a desk or table located near a window, get underneath it and pull your chair in as close as you can to shield yourself from possible breaking glass. Again, resist the urge to panic and flee. Remain calm even though you may witness the loss of electricity, the sound of various alarms, and activation of the fire sprinkler system. Do not be surprised by the noise from broken glass, creaking walls, or falling objects. The main thing to remember is remain calm and resist fleeing. If you're inside, stay inside. If you're outside, stay there. Resist the urge of running toward a building. Instead, find a safe location and drop, cover, and hold. Try to move to an open area, away from overhead power lines, building facades, architectural embellishments, or windows. If you're confined to a wheelchair, lock your wheels. Lean forward and cover your neck with your hands and arms. If you're in a stairwell, drop and cover next to an interior wall. Remain there until the tremor stops and follow directions that are announced over the public address system. In the restroom, remain there and cover your head with your arms and protect yourself from falling objects. If you're driving, gradually decrease speed Pull over to the side of the road and stay in the vehicle until the shaking stops. Do not stop under overpasses or bridges. Turn on the radio and listen for advisories and keep in mind aftershocks follow the initial quake. Do not begin to drive until local authorities have deemed it is safe to do so.